Welcome to yet another video of Innovia Tips and Tricks. Today we'll see how your 3D Experience Platform Administrator can easily configure the enterprise item number that suits your organization policy and makes product referencing a lot easier. The enterprise item number, also often termed as EIN, is used for product identification within single or sometimes multiple organizations that collaborate on product development. What you're seeing right now is an example of the EIN. Your administrator can use any combination of predefined text, attribute, user input, and counter to create a customized format for the EIM. Counter is often used to ensure the uniqueness of the EIM. Once the EIM formula is configured from the admin, users can set up EIM for the products through any apps mentioned in this slide. Now let's take a look at demo video that explains EIM formula configuration and also usage. Your administrator can use Collaborative Spaces Configuration Center and especially the engineering definition tile in it to create a customized formula for enterprise item number. When you click on the plus icon, a user dialog box appears that lets you configure the formula and decide its order as well. You can add in text field and enter a predefined text that you would want to be in the enterprise item number. You can also insert title attribute of a product in the formula. You can also use the customized string attribute as an attribute type in the formula. You can add few more text field that will act as a separator by adding a hyphen value for it. So you can see a hyphen is added in a text field that separates two segments of the EIN with each other. You can also add in user input field that allows user to enter specific alphanumerical value in the EIN. You can add in few more text fields and especially the hyphen as a value to separate two segments of the EIN. To ensure that each EIN is unique, you can also use a counter and decide its order in the formula. After adding a counter type, you can also select number of digits that you would like to have in the counter. Once the formula is completed, you can refer to it from the top bar of the formula. Once admin applies this formula, user can readily use it to enter the EIN for a specific products. You can see Sarah is selecting set enterprise item number and adding in user input for this particular product to set up its EIN. Once the EIN is set up, you can easily view it from the properties of given physical product. Thank you.